Welcome to Picture Healer Channel. This is Shi Tian. Today we want to talk about the Feng Shui chart for the month of June 2021. And we are following the same format as before. First, the month of June is defined by the 24 solar turns. So it starts from June 5th, planting grains until July 7, the small summer or the small heat. And there's always one solar turn in between. This one is June 21st, summer solstice. On the right side is the monthly flying star for June 2021. And you can see the center has number one. The number one is a very auspicious star. It usually indicates career success, increased wealth, and fame. So in general, this month is much better than the past few months. Here is the combination flying star chart, and I place the monthly star on the upper right corner. It doesn't have to be on the upper right. It's not like uh, the other system with the mountain star and water star. I just want to group the three numbers together to look at the general idea of the energy. Now let's start from the center and go clockwise on the map. The stars in the center include 6, 1, and 8. If you know feng shui or flying star feng shui, those three numbers are the most auspicious numbers. Number 1, 6, and 8, they all related to success, promotion, wealth, luck, and the prosperity. So this is a perfect combination. And it's also the best sector in June. So to take advantage of this good energy, you should stay more time here in the center. And you can have more activities here or music or movement or set it up as important rooms, even just for one month. And this is also a great area to place your money enhancers, such as money toad, the wealth god, crystals, or feng shui animals such as qilin or pishou. The next section is the west. We have number three star. The number three is a wood star, controls the number eight earth star. And the eight three combination can indicate intelligence and offspring luck. But on the other side, there might be some conflict between brothers and siblings. The next combination is number one and three. The number one is the water star, generates number three star. And it brings intelligence, fame, and money luck. But again, there is a possible conflict, legal trouble, or any argument. And the third combination is one and eight. The number one metal star generates number eight earth star. And this is a good combination. It brings wealth, luck, fame, and intelligence. Both are very lucky numbers. So in the West, this month, it has a lot of energy for intelligence and talent. So it's a good place to set up an office or a study room. But there's also possible conflict and argument. And we can add some fire element here to reduce the wood and balance the earth to reduce the conflicting energy. The fire element can be anything with actual fire, such as candles, lighting, fireplace, or just colors of red or orange. The next direction is northwest, and it's number two for the monthly star in June. The number two is an earth star, generates number seven metal star. This combination brings helpful people, but also possible relationship trouble, or illness, because number two is an illness star. And the number nine and two combination is a fire generating earth. So it's a very auspicious combination, indicating intelligence, increased wealth, and offspring luck. And the last one is the nine and seven combination. The number nine fire star controls number seven metal star. And this can mean obstacles or illness, especially related to fire element, such as eyes, blood, 
heart, or head. Here we can reduce fire energy by avoiding sharp objects and red color. And we can also display metal objects such as bronze bell, metal wind chime to reduce the number two illness star and avoid construction here this month. The next direction is north. The monthly star is number six. The number two Earth star generates number six metal star. And this combination brings good wealth luck but weak health. Again, the number two is an illness star. The second combination is six and four. Number six metal star controls number four wood star. This can mean power, talent, or success in a smaller scale, but it can also mean depression or mental issues. The third combination is four and two. The number four wood star controls number two earth star, and this can mean relationship problem, the imbalance of the power, or relationship trouble. So in the north, we can add a metal feng shui cure, such as bronze bell, metal clock, or wind chime, to reduce the number two illness star. And we should avoid construction here this month. The next direction is northeast. It's the number four star here. The number four is a wood star, generates number nine fire star. And this combination indicates intelligence, fame, and high social status. Because the number four is an intelligence star, so it can bring out intelligence, fame, and uh, popularity. The next combination is four and two. The wood star controls the number two earth star. And this can bring imbalance of relationships, especially with in-laws. And the third combination is nine and two. Fire generates earth. This can indicate wealth, fame, or relationship luck. So overall, it's a pretty lucky sector, but watch for relationship issues and uh, possible illness because of the number two illness star. And to reduce the number two illness star, we can place metal feng shui cure here and avoid construction this month. The next section is east. We have number eight star here, and the first combination is four and eight. The number four wood star controls number eight earth star, and this can indicate intelligence, but possible depression or illness. Next combination, number eight earth star generates number six metal star, and this can mean increased fame, wealth, promotion, and festive events. So this is a very lucky combination. The next one is six and the four combination. The number six metal star controls number four wood star, and this can mean power and intelligence, but also watch for your emotional health. So in the East, it shows fame and wealth, but pay attention to your emotional well-being, and you can add natural crystals to increase positive qi. The next direction is southeast. We have number nine star here. The number nine is a fire star, and it generates number five earth star. And this can mean unexpected illness, usually related to fire type of illness, such as issues related to head, blood, or eyes, or it can be unexpected festive events. So it can be either good or bad. The next combination is nine and seven. It's a fire controlling metal star. And this can mean issue related to fire element or issue related to females. The third combination is five and seven. The number five earth star generates number seven metal star. And this can bring illness, quarrel, or lawsuit because number five is a misfortune star. So we can reduce it with metal feng shui cure and uh, avoid construction here. 
and also avoid too much fire here, such as sharp triangle objects or red color. The next area is south. We have star number five here. The number five Wu Huang is an Earth star, controls the number one water star, and this can bring illness or accident. The second combination is three and five. As we said before, the number five is a misfortune star. So the south is not a very lucky area in June. The second combination is three and five. It's the wood controlling the earth, and this can mean robbery, accident, illness, or obstacles. The third combination is one and three. The number one water star generates number three wood star. This brings fame, intelligence, and wealth, luck. But on the other hand, the number three star can bring argument, gossip, or legal issues. So overall, this section is related to illness, conflict, and all kinds of obstacles in the month of June. And to reduce the number five star, we can add any metal feng shui cure and avoid construction here this month. Two other helpful feng shui cures include the dragon turtle and hulu, or the Chinese gourd. The hulu can absorb negative energy and bring good health. And the dragon turtle is also related to good health and the protection from negative energy. The last direction is southwest, and we have number seven as the monthly flying star. The number seven is a metal star and controls the number three wood star. And the three seven combination can mean power and wealth or fighting and accident. So this can be good or bad. The second combination is five and seven. The number five earth star generates number seven metal star, and this can bring illness, argument, or legal trouble. The third combination is number three wood star controls the number five earth star, and this combination indicates illness, obstacle, and accident. So overall, in the southwest, the stars can bring illness, conflict, and argument. And to reduce the power of the number five misfortune star, again we can place any metal feng shui cures, and avoid construction here. And we can also use hulu or dragon turtle to absorb negative qi and bring you protection. Here is a summary chart for June twenty twenty one, showing all nine sectors. And the best sector is the center. I give three stars here, and the areas with the cross is the areas we should be careful if you are concerned about health or illness. Most of the health-related areas are number two and five stars, and you can place any metal objects to reduce the two and five stars because they belong to the earth element. And I also show the basic five element enhancement for each direction, and the center is the best section during the months of June. So you can place any enhancers such as money toad, wealth god, wealth ball with coins, pisho, chilling, or crystals. If your bedroom or main entrance door is in a certain areas. You can pay more attention to those areas because you spend more time there. So that's the flying star combination chart for June twenty twenty one. I hope it's useful. Thank you for watching, and talk to you next time.